The organizer is where you'll see your folders, which is a great way to sort your products by area, categories, themes, or however you like. In the preloaded sample project, you'll see four folders and several subfolders. All items, unassigned, first floor, second floor, and so on. All items shows you all of your products regardless of which room they're assigned to. Unassigned shows you the products you've saved but have not assigned to any area. First floor and second floor show the products you've assigned to these respective floors, while the subfolders further break down your products into rooms. Folio also provides a two-dimensional capacity of organizing your products, something you can't do in Excel. Folders are an excellent way to sort your products when discussing the project with your client. This is because it makes it easier for the client to visualize each room and everything that's going to be in it. Meanwhile, schedules are very helpful when discussing the project with a collaborator, vendor, or contractor. You can create a new folder by clicking on the green plus sign, typing in the folder's name, and then hitting enter to save it. To create a subfolder, just hover over the icon here and then click Create Subfolder. Type in the name of your subfolder and a number if you like. You can use this number to correspond to room numbers on the floor plan. You can also rename, duplicate, and delete your folders and subfolders and even move them up and down. Adding, copying, and moving products across folders are easy and flexible. To move or copy an item, just click on the folder name in the folder column, then select all the folders or subfolders you want the item to be in. To move or copy more than one product to a folder all at once, just select all the items you need and then drag and drop them to the appropriate folder. If you want to add an item directly into a folder, just select the folder, then add your item through New Item, Quick Entry, or Add for My Library. As a note, you can also add a product directly into a folder through the Web Clipper and then copy it afterward into another folder by dragging and dropping. Want to add an item to several folders at once? Hold down your Control key or Command key if you're on a Mac and select your folders, then add your item like before. Let's say you're looking at all the products in your project, but you want to see which room a particular item is assigned to. Just click on the product and the folder or subfolder that contains it will be highlighted. The number of items and subtotal costs in each folder are automatically updated each time you add or remove a product. You can choose to show or hide the cost by going to Configure Template then toggling Client Total or whichever field you want on or off. It all depends on which total you want to see.